Okay, so what you'll do is go to Wix.com, click on sign in in the upper right hand corner. Now the username and password for this is Aaron.Nielsen27 at gmail.com. The password is Oregon with capital O, R E G O N 27 exclamation point. My bad. It's Oregon 27 with a capital O. So it's not with the exclamation point, just with the capital O. Once you're in, what we're going to do is um, create the shell to a new site. The vision is to have a place for all of our reps to go in and place bad orders. Um, we'll link websites and or uh, email addresses and all that uh, later on. So this is just the skeleton. Uh, any detail you can think of as far as the bats, the bat cuts, colors, all those kinds of things. Um, and, and certainly get as creative as you want with it. So we don't have the fastest internet on the bus. Come on, baby. Okay, once the editor comes up, you won't have to do this, but for future websites, this is how we'll do it. You click on create new site. We're going to pull from a template. And the only thing that we really worry about for this site is just the function of it. So I'm going to look at just a uh, like a single page, a one call it a one pager. Once that opens up, and we're just going to go to something simple. You have to worry about what it looks like. Let's go here. So you, whenever you pick the one that you want, you just click edit. And what we're going to do is we'll add an app to this site. Now apps are anything like a form builder or anything that allows our site to have some type of functionality. So for this particular site, we're just going to have the Harmony Bats. Uh, it'll be something called like Har Harmony Bats uh, Rep website or something like that. Pretty descriptive, straightforward, and obvious. And then we're going to build out the form. The form is what's going to take some time. Um, but as soon as the editor loads, we'll be able to do that. All right. Come on, baby. Okay, I'm going to uh, finalize the video. At this point, I'll make another one showing you how to use the uh, app for web or for form building. And the form that we're going to build is the one that has all the details for our bats and a spot down at the bottom for an individual to insert their rep ID. And the way that we'll do that is we'll create a rep ID drop-down list. And as we add reps, we'll just put their initials in there so that when they get to the bottom and they've placed the order for their bat, They'll hit the drop down. We'll know exactly who placed that order, and then we'll be able to commission that person out. So um, that's how that part will work.